Do you have a muscle strain, a fractured ankle, a sprained wrist, a contusion on your elbow, muscle or joint sprain, stiffness and or swelling? Well then we have something for you. Introducing the Universal Rapid Relief Reusable Gel Pack. If there's any problem big or small, Rapid Relief does it all. But don't take my word for it, just hear these paid, I mean actual customers. So I was shooting hoops. I was being awesome like always, with nothing but net every time. And then I fractured my ankle. First I immobilized the area above and below the fracture. Next, I called 911 with this large bone fracture. And I didn't know what to do next. But then I was given the Rapid Relief gel pack and I performed the rice method. Rapid Relief was worth every penny. You get Rapid Relief from muscle and joint pain, stiffness and swelling, and if you aren't completely satisfied, which I can't see why you would not be, you can return it absolutely free. Thank you, Rapid Relief. Although most fractures are not life-threatening, external or internal bleeding associated with fractures of large bones can be severe. Check the victim first for any life-threatening conditions and then care for the fracture. There are two types of fractures, closed and open. A closed fracture is a broken bone that does not penetrate the skin. However, internal bleeding may occur. An open fracture is a broken bone that penetrates the skin. An open fracture can be more serious because there is a greater chance of infection and serious bleeding. I was on my computer doing an epic report. And part right through, I had a muscle strain in my forearm. The strain is a stretching or tearing of a muscle. People commonly call strains a pulled muscle. With the Rapid Relief Gel Pack, I was able to finish my report 10 minutes before class started. With muscle strains, just simply apply the rice method. The reusable gel pack is great for all major joints and muscles, and it gives you complete freedom of movement during treatment. Thank you, Rapid Relief. Seek medical attention if pain is severe or persists, or if there is a significant or prolonged impairment of function. So I was just doing my usual demanding physical activity. And then out of nowhere, boom, I sprained my finger. Whenever there is an injury to your hands or finger that causes swelling, the victim's watch or rings can cut off circulation. Try to remove these before swelling occurs. All I did was immobilize the area and then use the rice method. With the rapid relief gel pack, all my worries were gone. And it can fit in your purse, not like I carry one or anything. It's great because it always stays flexible, it is non-toxic and latex-free. Now I'm going to seek medical attention. Thank you, rapid relief. Heat may also be beneficial for healing, just don't apply it soon after an injury. Heat applied too early would encourage increased circulation, resulting in more internal bleeding. Also, if heat was applied too early, it would increase swelling and would make nerve endings more sensitive to pain. Follow your healthcare provider's guideline and wait at least 72 hours after injury or until swelling goes down. Heat is beneficial for healing of sprains and strains because it causes blood vessels to dilate or enlarge, which allows more blood to reach the injured area. Increased circulation helps speed up the body's healing. Okay, so I have this Rapid Relief and Reusable Gel Packs. What about I about my wrestler and play and sport? Jogging, biking, and other forms of exercise are good for your health, but these activities can raise your risk for sprained joints, strained muscles, and other minor injuries. 
Properly treating these injuries can reduce the time you are sidelined. Should you have a pull, sprain, strain, tear, or other muscle or joint injury, treat it with the RICE method. The first step of RICE is rest. Any movement of a musculoskeletal injury can cause further injury, pain, and or swelling. With serious injuries, call 911 and have the victim rest until help arrives. With a fracture or dislocation, use a splint to immobilize the area. So you want to rest the injured wrist. The next step of rice is ice. Put ice or a cold pack on the injured area. Icing the injury reduces swelling, lessens pain, and minimizes bruising. Keep the ice on the area for 20 minutes on and then at least 30 minutes off. The ice or cold pack should be wrapped in cloth to prevent injury caused by cold and direct contact with the skin. Applying an ice pack early and often for the first 48 hours will help minimize swelling. Decreasing swelling around an injury will help to control the pain. The third step of rice is compression. Compressing the injury provides comfort and support and may prevent swelling. Compress the injured area with an elastic roller bandage. The bandage can be used for 24 to 48 hours as long as it is not too tight and the person can assess the injury to ensure that the bandage is not too tight. The final step of rice is elevation. Elevating an injured arm or leg uses gravity to help slow the blood flow to the injury, thereby helping minimize swelling and bruising. In all cases, elevate the injured extremity only if moving the limb does not cause pain. Elevate the injured area by using a sling to hold the wrist in place. Rice can relieve pain, limit swelling, and protect the injured tissue, all of which help to speed healing. There are times when the rice method is slightly modified. One instance is with dislocations. A dislocation occurs when bones in a joint become displaced or misaligned, often caused by sudden impact to the joint. You first want to immobilize the injured area. Next, call 911. If the dislocation is in the hand or foot, then you may instead be transported to the emergency room. Next, apply rice, but do not use a compression bandage if moving the joint causes pain. Finally, use a splint to keep the area immobilized. It is not always possible to tell a dislocation from a fracture, but first aid is very similar for both. Do not try to put the displaced bone back in place. After my ankle fracture healed, I took up a new sport, soccer. I was being awesome like always, with nothing but goal every time. And right when I was on a roll, I got a contusion on my ankle. A contusion is caused when blood vessels are damaged or broken as a result of a blow to the skin like a chair. Just apply the rice method and do not massage the injured muscle. Keep the cold pack on the area for 20 minutes and then 30 minutes off. Thanks again Rapid Relief. The microtechnology makes it smaller than a business card. There are situations when rapid relief and the rice method are not needed. Why are we telling you this? I don't know. But the first situation is cramping. A cramp occurs when there is a muscle pain or tightness. You can treat cramps by massaging the muscle. But through this special TV offer, you can get rapid relief right from the manufacturer for one easy payment of $4.99. But wait, there's more! I am so convinced that you will love the Rapid Relief Gel Pack that I am sending you an elastic roller bandage absolutely free. That's right, free. But don't forget to call because this is also available in stores. Here's how to order. Call 1-800-ICE-PACK to order the Rapid Relief Reusable Gel Pack for one payment of $4.99 and we'll send you the elastic roller bandage absolutely free. Just pay shipping and handling. So call 1-800-ICE-PACK. Must be 18 or older to call. That's 1-800-ICE-PACK. That's 1-800-ICE-PACK. Call now.